Hello everyone! So for today's video, I wanted to talk about a subject that's pretty sad. And I'm gonna be leaving Puerto Rico in about two days. So today I believe is March 21st and I'll be leaving on the 23rd, which is actually my birthday. But um, yeah, I just wanted to talk to you guys about my advice is for you guys, you know, coming to Puerto Rico. I know with this pandemic going on, you're probably thinking the last thing I want to do is, you know, go outside of the country. Puerto Rico is a part of the country, but go outside the continental United States. But I just wanted to tell you guys, in spite of this whole situation, if I could go back in time knowing what I know now, I wouldn't do anything differently. I don't mean that to be cliche, but I really do mean that. And if you're looking forward to going um, to study somewhere through the NSC program in the fall or the spring semester, I hope that this situation doesn't deter you. Not meaning that you shouldn't be cautious and stay safe, but rather hopefully and surely when this passes and that we all, you know, can get past the coronavirus, I hope that this doesn't incite fear in you, but rather just let you know that you never know what's going to happen when you go abroad, but that doesn't mean you should be afraid to try something different. I never would have imagined coming to Puerto Rico, there would be earthquakes the first day I arrived and that I would have to leave early due to a global wide pandemic, but you know, can't control things that are out of my control. And my friends and I were actually all leaving on the same day so that we could end Puerto Rico together, or rather end our time here together. But there's no doubt in my mind that I will come back to visit this island. I've made so many wonderful friends and honestly the memories that I've made are more important and worth more than the thought of the memories I could have made had I stayed here longer. Alright everyone, so the entire world has left Puerto Rico except my four friends and like a few other people. And everyone here is currently booking flights to go back home. So we shall see how long these vlogs will last. Thank you for making it this far with me. And hopefully when you go abroad Puerto Rico, there will not be a coronavirus. All right. Hi everyone, so currently I am packing. Unfortunately, I'm in the process of getting ready to leave Puerto Rico in two days, which is absolutely really sad. It's something I never imagined. It kind of looks like a mess right now, but you know, I just wanted to give you guys an idea of what the not so glamorous process looks like. Okay, everyone, so my friends and I have made it to the airport safely. Unfortunately, many of the stores are closed here and the whole airport is kind of deserted, but that's, that's all right. Hello, everyone. So I just landed in Charlotte, which is in North Carolina, for those who don't know. And my mother just took me to the airport. We're about to head home right now, which is my home is in South Carolina. So uh, today's my birthday. I'm recording this March 23rd, so I'm officially back from Puerto Rico, but I'm still gonna be continuing my classes online. So the semester is over the physical, but technically not really over. So due to that, I hope to keep updating you guys on my adventure, still being a student at the University of Puerto Rico, but just being one online. And what it's like, you know, take class online during quarantine, as I'm sure the majority of you are as well. So thank you so much for following my videos, especially back when I was actually in Puerto Rico, and hopefully you guys continue to follow as I'm here back home in South Carolina. So until next week, I will see you all then.